Hey guys, so this video is about fish turds and it's kind of a weird thing to talk about but when you're looking at your fish every day and you're enjoying them one of the first ways to detect uh, internal illnesses is by looking at their turds and if their poops are weird that's probably an indicator that something's going on. In this uh, tank here, I have a really old female Bosmani. She is really sick. I think she might be geriatric. She's just at the end of her life. Um, but if I don't freak her out too much, you can see that her turd is really stringy. It's inconsistent. And in the in between parts there, I don't want to get too graphic, but you just notice that it's not a consistent solid turd. It's this weird stringy thing. And so there's something going on with this fish. Typically that means that there's something internally going on with probably her digestive organs. It could be an indicator of internal parasites, maybe bacterial infection. It could, it could mean a number of things. And as a fish person, that could be your first indicator that the fish might not be presenting other symptoms. It might not be losing weight. It still might be eating. Um, its fins could look perfect. Its presentation looks fine. But you have something going on internally. Um, on these guys, I don't really have a good example of what healthy turd looks like. But it is a solid, consistent turd. It doesn't change color. Uh, it doesn't change consistency. It's like a log. So, you know, this, with these fish, Bosmani rainbows, they're really susceptible to parasitic infections, especially nematodes. So I've, I treated all my fish with levamisole, which is an anti-helminthic. It selects nematodes or roundworms. I treated my fish when I got them. And so I know that these guys don't have it. That's just because I, I, I selected for those right off the bat when I purchased all my fish and set up this 120. Uh, this other female I got, she was the sick one was way late to the party and, and something else could be going on. So I'm not a veterinarian, so I'm not going to prescribe how to treat your fish. But if you think that something's going on, one thing I like to use is the New Life Spectrum Thera A. And uh, this food is fortified with garlic. And garlic shows some uh, help for internal parasites. So that's something you could try. I don't, I don't solely use New Life Spectrum. I use all sorts of good quality foods like Extreme and Bloodworms and stuff. But... You could try that. Also, what I found effective is metronidazole. Um, it's sold as an antibiotic, but it's also indicated for internal parasitic infections as well. So you might want to try that. Go to your local fish store, talk to somebody that's actually really smart, that knows tons about fish and they can help you. Don't go and talk to somebody that's only been working there for a couple months. No offense to anybody. But yeah, look at your fish's poop. It could be a great indicator of health or it could be an indicator of sickness. Hope that helps you guys out. Have a great day.